Put more within reach in just 15 minutes with a Radiant GFCI outlet with USB charging. To start, turn off the outlet's power at the breaker. Then, double check the outlet to be sure there is no power. You can use a circuit tester or plug in a handheld appliance to confirm it won't turn on. Absolutely nothing should be done at the outlet until you have guaranteed the power is off. Remove the existing outlet by unscrewing the wall plate. And then slightly pulling the outlet from the wall. This will give you access to its attached wiring. Before disconnecting any wires, label them to avoid confusion. Typically, black wires are hot, white wires are neutral, and the bare wire is ground. Check the back of the outlet for which wires are line and which are load. Label them appropriately. Disconnect the wires from the existing outlet by unlooping them, or you can snip them if the wires are long enough. For the ground wire, instead of cutting it, pull it from its position around the terminal screw to keep the looped shape. This makes it easier to connect to the new outlet. Strip the hot and neutral wires to half inch using the gauge on the device strap to measure. Check the back of the device for line and load markings. Then, attach the wires to the new outlet per the included installation instructions. Match your labeled wires to the correct terminal screws. Once all the wires are installed properly, tighten each terminal screw. To make sure the outlet fits neatly back into the wall, pre-fold the stripped wires before connecting them to the outlet. Gently push the folded wires back into the wall and screw the new outlet into the wall box. Screw the wall plate subframe to the device. Then, simply snap on the screwless wall plate for a sleek, finishing touch. Lastly, turn the power back on at the breaker and push the reset button. Test the GFCI outlet per the outlet instruction sheet. Now, it's time to start charging.